Hello everyone, this is Kiki Jones. The other day, documents of Nike Masco have been added to UNESCO's memory of the world register. This is a crisis, and this registration should be embodied. The reason why is because Nike Masco is a big scam. China gets Japan's ODA while telling the lie. In the first place, the founding of a country of China is after the war. China should die of shame to retell false rumor. According to many trustworthy history study, there was no eyewitness who lived in Nanki City at the time. There was no dead body and stink of dead body at there. Those things contradicts that 300,000 people were killed. And on the top of that, China haven't been worried about this issue until 1980. Because China had known the truth. That means that Japanese army killed some guerrillas. If there was some execution in Nanking, Japanese troops did it as legal actions. That's all. I'm wondering if soldiers except Japanese could be clear, guerrilla, or citizen who was shedding uniform and hiding among civilians. 300,000 people were killed? That's ridiculous. That's as much as they know. So, this resistor should be embodied. But I want to say one thing. I think that UNESCO's memory of world resistor should be needed for all of the people because it has not been registered white people's crime. Obviously, white people abducted countless thousands of black people by force. I know that the abduction, slavery, sex slave, slaveholder, slave market was infested. The almost farmer advance were completely destroyed by white people in Europe, in America, in Australia. So, memory of the world register is very important. Needless to say, China is exactly throttling Tibetan Uyghur persons now. The country Eastern Turkestan had been banished by Chinese nuclear test. That means Eastern Turkestan people were killed by China. Don't you think that UNESCO is abused by China? It goes without saying that China is up to hide their misgovernment from 1,300 million nations in China. It's not only China but also Korea. Korea has nothing but fabricated histories. Imperial Japanese troops had never kidnapped 200,000 Korean women at the World War II. Korea makes me sick. So, if you believe the issue called Nanking Massacre, you would turn out to be folks of the wicked person, like Chinese and Koreans. It seems that Miss Irina Bokoba participated the military parade of China this year. Now, I'm asking you, you don't have to be like the information warfare. Just now, maybe we can put the brakes on Chinese evil deeds. In any case, UNESCO should invalidate the document of Nagi Masco and Japan should refuse to pay a share of the expenses of the UNESCO. We should normalize the UNESCO so that it's the best way to stop the arrogant behavior of China. By the way, there are great crimes that we shouldn't miss out on as a human being. Two autumn bombs which were dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. More than 200,000 Japanese civilians were killed in 1945. The civilians burned to death were not soldiers or guerrillas. When is it? That tragedy is registered by American brave 
with apology. Thank you. Bye bye.